As a film studio, it's easy to put an inspirational poster on the wall that says who you are. But how do you go further and actually build a culture in which artists can thrive? Let's take a look at how 31 Films builds its culture and some tips on how you can too. Hi there, I'm Joey with 31 Films. We are a production studio just outside of Houston, Texas. Over the years, we've built an awesome space and amazing team here at 31 Films. We'd love to share with you the biggest things we've learned. I believe culture, one in which artists can really create, grow, and succeed is defined by three things. The overall environment, your management style, and your team of people. Really, it's the people that you bring in and who they are that defines the culture. It's about bringing in the right people and supporting them with the right environments and management style to guide them in the right direction. First, the people. At 31 Films, we have a strong team of people who are hardworking, fun, and push one another to be better. It's important for us to really think about who we want to spend our time with. And we make sure that everybody on the team is fun to be around and really enjoys being a part of the studio. For you, take the time to think about what three qualities are most important to you. And as you look to bring on people, try to seek out those that are a good fit. It's more work than just looking for talented people, but it's huge in building a culture. Second, the environment. As we build our studio, we thought about what we wanted our culture to be. And then we looked to make our space a reflection of that. For example, we really wanted our space to feel collaborative, but we also wanted everyone to be able to focus and be efficient. We designed each office so that it could fit two people surrounded by glass walls so that the space would feel open and inviting. There are a lot of public spaces where folks can grab lunch together. These spaces provide people with opportunities to discuss what they're working on, while the offices allow folks to close the doors and focus. For us, it was so important that the space was a reflection of the studio's personality first, and not primarily a marketing tool to entertain clients. But clients do end up really loving the space, and it plays a big part in bringing people in. Third, the management style. One of the biggest things we've learned is that culture trickles down from the top. How you interact with your team has a big impact on the culture. If you're stressed, they're going to be stressed. And if we want our team to have ownership over their projects, we need to make sure we don't micromanage them. So we again looked at the type of culture we wanted to have and tried to make sure that was always reflected in how we interacted with our team. That encourages them to do the same. <laughs> what do you say to your team when you bring them on board? And how do you express the culture you want to see at your studio? There's no initial meeting where we bring everyone together and say, this is who we are now. Instead, from the very beginning, decide what you want the culture to be. Take the time to write it down and then bring that to life. For us, creating a culture in which everyone thrives means bringing in the right people with a strong work ethic and a good personality and supporting them in an environment that promotes creativity and collaboration, and a management style that holds them accountable, but lets them take pride in their work. When you think about the kind of work culture you'd like to have, what is the most important thing to you? Share this and any questions you have about building culture in the discussion area below. You just learned something new to up your filmmaking game? Well, learn even more with our other tutorials and remember to subscribe to know when new videos are released. Got questions? Ask away in the comment section. Or just say hi. Hi. How you doing? I'm good. If you're asking. <laughs>